Well, hello there. I'm back again. So much stuff going on. I like my pen. If you like my pen, like my video. <laughs> and the news is just this. Nicole Ari Parker is to join Sex and the City reboot in place of Kim Cottrell. Nicole Ari Parker has been billed to replace Kim Cottrell in the new Sex and the City reboot. reboot. After the backlash that accompanied the news that the era-defining show's most iconic character, Samantha, is done. Bye-bye. Ari Parker, known for starring in the acclaimed series, I'm just reading, Empire, as well as Paul Thomas Anderson's Boogie Nights. And we all know who she married to, fine as Boris. No disrespect, but he fine. She will reportedly replace Cottrell as the fourth member of the New York friend group, according to the Mail on Sunday. Ari Parker, who is 50 and aging like a whoa, boy, black don't crack. She looks amazing. We'll play Carrie Bradshaw's new best friend, documentary maker, Lisa Todd Wexley. The re reboot will be titled, and just like that. Because two years ago, Cottrell made it very clear that she felt her association with the series was over. And she said in her words, I went past the finish line playing Samantha Jones because I love Sex in the City. It was a blessing in so many ways. But after the second movie, I have had enough. I couldn't understand why they wouldn't just replace me with another actress instead of wasting time bullying. No means no. And based on the book by Arthur Candace Bushnell, Bushnell, Sex in the City revolves around the fashion obsessed relationship colonist Carrie and her three friends, Miranda and Charlotte and Samantha. It first aired in 1998 and ran for six seasons, winning seven Emmys and eight Golden Globes. After the re reboot was announced in January, many said the show, which has long been criticized for its lack of diversity, seemed dated and would need a significant cultural rethink. Chelsea Fairless, the co-founder of Every Outfit on Sex and the City, said in 2018 that the show was as white as it gets. Hmm. She didn't lie. They didn't even, they didn't ever have a person of color as a regular. True, because I watched the show and I did like the show. As well as Ari Parker's starring role, the reboot will introduce three characters played by people of color with Sarah Ramirez, Karen Pittman, and Sarita Child Hurry to join the quartet. Warner Media said the new series would follow the characters as they navigate the journey from the complicated reality of life and friendship in their 30s to the even more complicated reality of life and friendship in their 50s. It will consist of 10 half-hour episodes and it will air on HBO Max. I'm already subscribed. Are you? I like Sex in the City and I think it's a good idea to bring on women who look like myself. We're good. And I will say, because they didn't mention it, Nicole Ari Parker starred in the spinoff series to the movie Soul Food. And she was a starring character. So they didn't mention that, but I'm going to mention it. So you all, let's support because of her. Like some of y'all that support, you know, R-B-O-H. Because of Garcelle, you know. We need to support our women of color when they get these roles in areas where normally you don't see anyone that looks like us being a starring actress, mainly just brought on for a an episode and that's about it. But 
let's watch tune in and if you're not subscribed to hbo max get into it and like my video subscribe to my channel and grow with me because the more you watch the more you like my videos the more youtube will boost me up on the algorithm it's not that bad here i'm just saying like my video bye